Okay, and so then what's kind of strange here is it's like, okay, so you'd think, okay, this should bubble, right? Well, do these coatings and, but then you get onto the crystals in here and I'm not seeing much of a reaction on the crystals. Some reaction, you can see a little bit of bubbling in the water under like this piece right here. So I would guess there's some limestone sediment, uh, calcite, but the crystals themselves, just not seeing anything, see? So that tells us we do not have calcite. While this could look like calcite, it is not calcite. That has been ruled out with the vinegar test. Because even with household vinegar, you would have a reaction. So the crystals aren't calcite. The reaction on the outside, the coating here. God, that almost looks like quartz. Um, this is going to be fun to dig into, isn't it? It looks like there's some limestone associated with these rocks. And I think that's what's causing the bubbling. So over here, you know, again, it's that coating you see bubbling up. But the crystals themselves, I bet, are not. I'll flip it over. I gotta clean the other side. There's bigger crystals on the other side. Hold tight. All right, again, so this is like barely diluted, 80% concentrated vinegar. These are the bigger crystals I was referencing and yeah, there's a little bit of bubbling in there. Not a lot. Again, I think it's the sediment. I really think it's a limestone involved in that host rock. And then these down here, you would think for sure, right? Totally looks like calcium carbonate, but then... Uh, is there a reaction? I guess there is a little reaction there. So, yeah. I mean, this could be some, probably some limestone. I don't know a lot about calcium carbonates because I just don't run into it very often. So let me know, what kind of uh, calcium carbonates make this coating on these rocks? I would love to know. I really appreciate it. Um, so my specialty, my niche, I guess, is the crystals. I'm a gemologist and a rock hound and I like to try identifying crystals in my rough mineral specimens and rocks. So the geology part, and even mineralogy to some extent, I put a lot of work into it. See that reaction? So is that limestone? Um, yeah, the geology and paleontology, which is the studying fossils, um, is a work in progress. I, uh, I would say my expertise is the crystals. So natural gemstones and crystals that you find in rough mineral specimens and rocks, concretions, geodes, that type of thing. That is, uh, that is what I focus on. So I could really use your help with, uh, some of the rock in these uh, mineral coatings. I mean, not a ton of reaction, but it's there. All right, I'm gonna clean these guys up.